what's up you guys welcome back to my girl's channel welcome back to the channel you guys you know the vibes or do you know the vibes you know the vibes or do you know the vibes it's another car talk with your girl okay we are in alaska living our best life we are in the car and when i do these car talks you guys it's really not only for me but it's only it's also for you guys like if anyone else needs to hear this it's for you as well a lot of times in life we can kind of um why is my car shaking a lot of times in life we can put this this hold back this setback on our lives and we don't realize that we're doing it it's almost subconscious like this is just a little inspiration or motivation for anyone who was in the same boat as me where you kind of just you know that you're supposed to be somewhere but you don't allow yourself to get there a lot of us see ourselves as okay i know i want to get there i know that i can be this i know i have the potential to get to that place and open those doors and walk in those buildings but we're stuck because we don't know how to do it we don't know oh, we feel like we don't have the right resources we feel like we're not doing the right things but realistically we just have to put ourselves in the mindset that it may not look the way that we want it but it's gonna be there you get what i'm saying the packaging may be different the the colors may be different the delivery may be different but it's still going to be that so that's for anyone who is in the same boat where it's almost like hold yourself back don't hold yourself back you know and this is i'm going to look back at this video because i know i the places i want to go i know how big i want my business to be i know the rooms that i want to be in the people that i want to be networking with so it's like we have to allow ourselves to be uncomfortable we have to allow ourselves to walk into those rooms we not may not be ready for it but it's almost like manifesting it you get what i'm saying affirmating yourself to say i'm gonna be here one day i may not be here now although i'm walking in here and i'm setting myself in this moment in this setting to say i can be here i will be here it may not be in this moment but it's gonna happen you get what i'm saying so that's for anyone if this is your first video if this is the, your first time on my channel um welcome and i'm just approaching this channel with purpose that's what my thing is now i want to approach this channel wholeheartedly because i'm becoming a new woman i'm becoming more mature than what i ever thought i could be and i'm enjoying it and i'm enjoying this process of watching myself grow so if you want all things growth you want prosperity you want blessings just continue watching this channel because i believe that god not only provides messages for me but he also provides messages for other people as well so something happened today that i think a lot of us can relate to coming here in a different state i'm sure we've all moved before and it's uncomfortable i didn't realize it would be this uncomfortable but moving is very life-changing and i told myself and i prayed to god that i would be in a better situation than what i was back home I want God to increase the way my life is. I don't want to keep going back and opening old doors. You get what I'm saying? So coming here, like the pay is different. Um, the environment is very different from back home. And now I'm looking at God and I'm starting to question God. Like, why are you putting me back? You know, when I'm in a different state, I'm supposed to be, be increasing. I'm supposed to be enjoying life. I'm supposed to be... Like prosperity is supposed to be in my name. Like what's going on? It almost had to be a moment where I had to accept what God was giving me in that moment because there was going to be greater. Sometimes when we pray for things that we know we need, we just know in our spirit that that's best for us. Sometimes we have to realize that although we're praying for it, and if God gives us an opportunity that, that looks different from that, that's not God denying your prayer that's god just saying not right now you may not be ready for it you get what i'm saying so i just felt like oh my gosh god you're giving me granted an opportunity but it's not the one that i want it's not the one that's putting me further in life it's a situation that i'm getting paid less than what i was getting paid at home but god showed me so much within that time frame that it's prepared me for this moment that he gave me today and a lot of times people go through this mindset where it's like oh why am i here why am i here and then when the opportunity comes they're like but am i worthy of this and i got my opportunity today and i prayed to god i'm like lord if this is you 
let it happen you get what i'm saying when i finally let go of validating other people's feelings validating how other people feel about me i realized i cannot make everybody happy with me going into the role that i want to go into i want to speak to other people the way i talk is not going to be for everybody it's not going to target everybody i don't have to please everybody because where i want to go a lot of people aren't going to like that and it's okay so with the blessing that i got today and the opportunity that i got today i started questioning myself even after asking god to confirm i'm like mm, am i actually worthy of this opportunity but a lot of times we have to realize that that's when the enemy starts to come into our mind and say do you really want this opportunity are you really ready for something like that and that's when the enemy tries to close the doors that god is trying to open for you so this is for anyone that's like me you're kind of like pessimistic like yeah is it really for me am i really ready go into that door you may feel you may be scared shitless honey you may be afraid but it's okay walk into that door and make a fool of yourself be afraid because that's where growth happens if you are so stagnant in yourself and there's no growth you're not going to get to those levels that you want to go to and i found myself in a negative mindset and the enemy who just had his hands on me and i'm like lord i need deliverance because the way i'm thinking the way i'm processing things is all negative it's all i wasn't giving no affirmation to myself to my spirit i was just being negative so that's for anyone who's watching this if you find yourself in a negative space please break out of that that is not a place you need to be in especially if you want to grow if you want to go places if you want to be places last night i was telling my husband because my husband opened his bible and i'm like god just gave me a verse um it was psalm 16 and we literally knocked out we didn't even read it and um my husband woke up for work and i woke up at five o'clock in the morning and this is like you guys god will wake you up in the middle of the night anyways psalm 16 there's a verse in between those lines that said god drops the boundary lines and pleasant places for his people and it snapped i'm like god all those boundary lines that the enemy or the other people had for me they're gonna drop immediately and i pray that they're gonna drop for not only me, but also for you. Whatever boundary lines you put for yourself, saying, oh, I can't go there because of this. I won't be able to go there. Stop talking like that. Stop having that mindset because that's preventing you from actually going those places. People don't realize how strong and powerful the mind and how powerful the tongue is. Speak goodness about yourself. The same way you speak good about other people, have that same energy towards yourself. You know what I'm saying? Whoever's watching this video, if you come across it and you're like damn i need a little bit of motivation um i'm very stagnant what's going on in my life girl this or guy this is for you because i found myself in that situation as well so if this is your first time on my channel subscribe join the family because there's going to be so much more opportunities for us to grow together and understand how to just get through this thing like it's called life like life is hard like lifing as an adult is so different now i understand why our parents tell us to stop trying to grow up so fast because life is hard but long story short if this is your first time if you are a returning viewer make sure you like this video and comment because i like engagement i do not just want people to watch this video and not say anything engage with me if there's anything that i said that you disagree with let me know i love a good debate so yes make sure you like comment subscribe and i pray that you have prosperity and blessings over your life today and peace girl